Javier's decision. What will he decide? Kids today have so many distractions that prevents them from thinking about their future. Their smartphones, social media, television streaming services, and virtual gaming. It's a wonder they get anything done. The jobs of tomorrow demands a highly trained workforce. There's already shortages in many industries. That's why it's important for youth to plan early for their future careers. My name is Mrs. Turner. My 10th grade class is in the process of exploring career paths. Hi, my name is Javier. I'm in Mrs. Turner's class and I'm trying to figure out what career path to take for my future. I hear I should have started this process much earlier. He really should have. My name is Veronica and I am Javier's mother. I am worried that he isn't taking this process seriously. I want him to have a future where he can thrive on his own. Javier, ¿qué vas a hacer con tu vida? Life isn't going to wait for you to decide. Good morning, class. Today we're going to talk about something very important. As you begin to think about your future career, it's important to consider all the possibilities available to you. While college might be the traditional path for many, skilled trades offer an excellent opportunity for those who prefer to work with their hands. How many of you know what career you would like to pursue? My dad wants me to become an engineer, but I can't see myself in school for six or more years. According to data from E3 Alliance, students have only a 12% chance of earning a living if they don't complete a post-secondary credential within six years of high school. Those aren't good odds. Some parents we interviewed expressed concerns that their kids might not have the opportunity to grow. But they can climb the ladder. Climbing the career ladder allows you to move up in your career field, giving you an opportunity to grow. Mrs. Turner, why do we have to decide on our careers now? Deciding on a career early allows you to plan your high school classes accordingly. If you knew you want to pursue a career in the medical field, for example, you can focus on taking science and math courses to prepare you for that path. I have a hard time deciding what cereal I'm going to have in the morning. I'm thinking about becoming a plumber or welder. You mean cleaning toilets? Why would you want to do that? My Uncle Joey is a plumber. He knows how to read blueprints and design piping systems, and he never went to college. He has a big house and a nice car, and my mom is always borrowing money from him. Class, it's decision-making time. Let's hear about your career choices on Monday. How was school? Okay. Mrs. Turner gave us all an assignment to help us decide on a career. Have you decided? I thought you would follow in your father's footsteps. Mrs. Turner said we have to go with our own interest, and she told us there are other career paths. Now that's the most sensible plan I've heard from you. You can say that again. The class visited various industries last week. They all had an opportunity to see a variety of industries hands-on. While sleeping, Javier has a dream that he's on a game show called Climb the Ladder. In the game show, he meets people from different skill trades. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Climb the Ladder. We have a kid from Austin named Javier who is trying to make a decision about his future. We entered his dream to help him decide. Let's welcome our host, Peachy Paulette Green. Good morning, everyone. I'm so happy to be here today. Looks like Javier has some decisions to make. Since this is a dream, we'll forego all the formalities and get right into it. Paul, Javier told his mother he wants a job where he can work with his hands. So I'm an electrician. I finished a registered apprenticeship program. And after years in the field, I became a site manager for an architecture firm. Javier, I'm a welder. I worked on military ships for years before starting my own business building container homes. I use BIM software to design the floor plans and make models for the homes. Pick me. 
Pick me, Javier. I'm an HVAC technician, which stands for heating, ventilation, air conditioning, and refrigeration. I install, maintain, repair, or replace air conditioners, ventilation units, refrigeration equipment, and more. Wake up, Javier. Javier, levántate. <sighs> I was dreaming that I was in a game show and the host had green hair. Welcome back, class. Javier, it's your turn. Have you decided? I want to become a welder, and even if I decide it's not for me, I could advance by climbing the ladder to become a project manager, an estimator, a CAD designer, or a welder. Looks like you're headed for a great future. <laughs>